Welcome to 2015. I'm an integrative health expert here with Old Fashioned Health and your guide to living healthy naturally. I am determined, and I hope you are too, to make 2015 our best year ever. And let me tell you why. We've learned so much about health, we've learned so much about nutrition, but this is the year that I am going to help you put it all together to find a plan for you. Here's a couple of things you can do to start out with. The first thing I do, which I would encourage all of you to do too, is to whip out a big 2015 calendar and draw and write down your goals for the year. I do this every year. Usually I do it New Year's Eve or the first day of the new year, January 1st. And I will promise you that every year I have done it, everything I have written down has come true. So get that calendar out, write down your goals, and make a part of them your health goal. Let me share, share with you what my goals are. My number one goal, this is the year I'm returning to yoga. I've forgotten my yoga in the last few years. I've been busy, I've been stressed, I've been running around, I've done a lot of crazy things, all of them wonderful, but this is the year I want to return back to calming my nervous system down, going back to a regular yoga practice. So that's my number one goal. Think about what your number one exercise goal might be. My second goal is to really, again, in the same theme, learn to manage my mind. Think about for your, that for yourself as well. So much of every behavior that we do is because we don't have good discipline over our mental health. And I'm guilty of the same thing. If I get overstressed, I'm doing things that maybe aren't the best for me. So how am I going to get that goal? I want one electronic free hour every day turning everything off. That's right, the computers, the TVs, the phones, all of it, I'm getting rid of it so I can focus one hour a day on either interacting more with my family, taking 10 minutes to meditate, maybe even writing in a journal, and seeing if I can maybe move forward and accomplish more because my mind is clear. So maybe make that your second goal. Exercise, clearing your mind, and finally nutrition. It's always a goal. I'm not going to set a silly goal like I'm going to lose weight or eat right. Those are too vague and they often set you up for failure. Instead, think about something very specific. I know what it is for me. For me, I'm going to do one green juice every day and I'm going to increase my healthy fats because I find that when I'm busy, I forget them and I notice it in my skin and my hair and just my overall vitality. So those are my three goals for the new year. I hope they help you in determining yours and Happy New Year. Thanks for watching. I'm Dr. Taz with Old Fashioned Health, an integrative health expert and your guide to living healthy naturally in 2015. Happy New Year.